Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, I Eat Fashion. Can you guys see me? Yes. So I just finished filming and I thought because I'm so hungry right now, I thought it would be a dope idea to show you guys what I eat in a day. So I'm going to show you guys an entire day's worth of food or what I would eat. I'm not on a Pediman. As you guys know, it's my previous video. I recently stopped taking a Pediman, but I still... Um, try to intake 3,000 calories to keep my weight, maintain my weight that I currently have. And I've been doing good so far. I do eat a lot throughout the day, but in small sections, like small, I wouldn't say small. Yeah, no, some portions aren't small, but you guys will see it in the video. And um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. I am gonna be doing a MACA um, update on me gaining weight or maintaining weight on MACA. So stay tuned for that video as well. But I'm gonna show you guys what I eat in a day. And so thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in my next video. Let's get this video started. I just wanted to say, y'all, I'm not a dietitian. I'm not a nutritionist. Um, some of the things that I do eat aren't, I know, the healthiest options that I can choose. But so I'm going to focus on myself and, you know, try to wing myself out of eating not so much of uh, unhealthy things. But I just want to let you guys know that that the I'm not a nutritionist. I'm not a dietitian. I'm not telling you that if you eat these same exact things, you're going to look like me. Um, or look better than me or whatever the case may be. I'm just showing you guys what I eat to obtain 3,000 calories in a day. So in the mornings, I like to um, drink a shot of apple cider vinegar. If you are not familiar with apple cider vinegar, Google everything that um, apple cider vinegar does. It promotes a lot of health benefits. It's too many to list in here, so just Google it if you are unfamiliar with apple cider vinegar. And when you do get the bottle, make sure you get the one with the mother. I'm almost finished as you guys can see, but I only take a shot of the cap. So I'm going to take that. I then like to make a smoothie in the morning. So. Okay, so for my smoothie, I'm going to take two bananas and I like them to be fairly ripe because they're sweeter, right? Almond milk, you can get whole milk, um, which is more calories than almond milk. But my boyfriend does not like um, whole milk, so this is what we have to use. So this is our smoothie, which is just banana and milk. Oh guys, I also wanted to show you if you add dry oats into your smoothie as well, um, it's a lot of calories impacted in these dried oats, 150 per half a cup. So that is also another way to get some gains in. Um, I also add honey when I do mine because the taste doesn't taste all that, but I didn't do it in this particular smoothie. I'm just showing you guys 150 calories for a half a cup. Um, eating scrambled eggs with cheese, three pieces of bacon, and it's a total of five biscuits. I'm going to eat three now and those other two maybe in a couple of hours. I usually put honey and butter on my biscuits um, and salt and pepper on my eggs. Nothing extravagant. I'm not the best of the best of the chefs, but this is breakfast. That's probably like a snack, a snack in the next two, one to two hours if I'm hungry again. This is breakfast. Eating a pack of these, it's 100 calories, and these are almonds. Usually, I would just grab a handful of those cinnamon ones, but I'm gonna eat these. So, 100 calorie snack with a bottle of water. Lunch is super simple, y'all. Um, I'm having avocado toast, which is just toasted two pieces of bread with butter on it, and then I spread the avocado on the bread. I sprinkle salt, pepper, and garlic powder, and that's it. My, my kitchen is a mess, but I stay eating fruit as well in between meals. So 
Of course, you saw that I ate the bananas this morning, but I usually have watermelon or cut up a pineapple or some mangoes. Also have some avocados that I want to ripe a little bit more, but I eat avocados plain as well with maybe just adding salt and pepper. Sometimes I don't need even salt and pepper. I can just eat it like it's yogurt, like it's ice cream, just scoop it out and eat that. But throughout the day, um, if I'm not eating almonds, I will have some fruit, y'all. So get you some fruit. It is very healthy for you. It also makes you taste sweet. I just want to show y'all, like I stay with water. So with every meal, I'll have a cold water bottle with every meal, guys. So for dinner, I'm having a rack of ribs. I'm gonna have a half, and my boyfriend's gonna have a half, and also mashed potatoes from scratch. Little baby Dutch yellow potatoes. They look like this, and they're little teeny potatoes. They also come in these um, purple shades, but I love these. I can eat, um, I can eat these all the time, y'all, as snacks. So. This is what I make my mashed potatoes with. This, milk, butter, and um, seasoning. And yeah, and I used maybe like eight of these. And I kept the skin on it and mashed it, so yeah. All right, y'all, I just came from the gym and I'm going to have this huge salad. It is impacted with um, a pack of those almonds that were 100 calories, a cup of grilled chicken, a boiled egg, and then I also have like lettuce, tomato, cheese, and um, I'm going to use dressing as well. And I also have two ears of corn on the side that I use butter and um, salt and pepper on that I'm going to eat. But I am going to finish this off. This will be my last meal of the day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I don't mind doing another one of these like series of what I eat in a day. Showing you guys how I pack on these calories guys. Getting these um, gains in. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know um, what you eat in a day to get you those healthy gains. And um, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Until next time, peace out.